Hello everyone and welcome to our lesson for today. For today's lesson, we will be focusing on feel the beats. So let's get started. Materials. All you need is just your thinking cap for our lesson today. So let's get our brains ready. There are two learning targets for our lesson today. The first target says, I can review what I have learned about syllables and rhymes. And our second target says, I can feel and count the syllables or beats in the words of a poem. Question and answer. Let's practice what we've learned so far. Listen to these words and let's see which one doesn't rhyme. Cot, lot, get, tot. Which word does not rhyme? Yes, get does not rhyme with our other words. Get does not have the same ending sound as cot, lot, and tot. They all have the ot sound and get does not. Nice job. Let's take a look at some other words. Day, play, clay. Can you think of another rhyming word that also ends with the A sound that would fit? Good. Any word that has the A sound at the end could work. Like stay, hey, may. All of those words would fit in our rhyming words. Now I want you to listen for the syllables that you hear in these words. This is swimming. How many syllables do you hear in the word swimming? Good, two, swimming. Two syllables, two beats. How about this one? How many syllables do you hear in the word hen? Right, just one. Hen, one syllable, one beat in the word. What is the first sound that you hear in our word rest? What is the first sound you hear? Good, yes, you hear the R sound, the R sound in the word rest. And here's our last one. What is the first sound you hear in the word zipper? Good, you hear the Z sound for the letter Z. Awesome work with all of the sounds. Nice job. Now I want you to listen to these words and listen and tell me the last sound you hear. Listen to the word. Pet, let, set. What is the last sound you hear in these words? Yes, the last sound is the t sound for the letter T. How about these next words? Listen for the sound that you hear at the end of these words. Dead, bed, head. What's the last sound you hear in these words? Awesome. The last sound is the d sound for the letter D. Now I'm going to clap out the syllables for a word and I want you to blend it together and tell me what the word is. You ready to listen? Little. What is the word? Yes, the word is little. Little. It has two syllables. Little, just like the rock that is in this little hand. Yes. Nice job blending the words together. Read aloud. 
I looked in my camera and what did I see? Two African animals looking back at me. I looked in my camera and what did I see? A zebra with a bushy mane and an elephant on the plane. My first thought was, how can they be so tame? Swimming with a jellyfish was not the same. I looked in my camera and what did I see? Not a jellyfish swimming toward me. The jellyfish sting made me sing. I looked at my camera and what did I see? Lots of memories flooding back to me. Wow, so much rhythm and so many beats in our poem. Sounds. Listen to the line from this poem one more time. I looked in my camera and what did I see? How many beats are in the word camera? Yes, three. Camera. What is the first syllable in the word camera? Yes, cam. What is the second syllable in the word camera? Yes. Er. And what is the last syllable in the word camera? Yes, a. Uh. How many beats are in the word looking? Yes, two. Looking. What is the first syllable you hear in the word looking? Yes, look. And what is the second syllable you hear in the word looking? Yes, ing. Great job. Here is a word with only one syllable. Main. Let's break that word into the beginning sound and the ending chunk. Ready to listen? Mm ain. Mm. Ain. Can you do that? Great job. Closing reflection. How do we know that C and me are rhyming words? Yes, because words that rhyme have the same ending sound. And how might that help us with reading and writing? Nice job. Nice job finding syllables. Listen to the words around you today and try to find a word with even more beats. Thanks for joining me again today. I hope you had fun clapping out all of the syllables and finding the beats in our word. I hope you had a great time and I will see you next time. Bye.